All right, so I'll do this video to show how to change uh, your buttons. Uh, this would be for the arcade games for MAME emulators. So I've already fixed this one up, this track and field, but it used to be left and right button were this, and then this would be like jump or throw to pole vault, whatever. So I was able to change it to this is left and right to run, and then this is jump, which is how it is in the arcade. So to change the buttons, you want to push this button and this button at the same time. So like this, and it'll bring up this menu here. Then you want to go to options. And then in options, you'll display main menu, and turn that on. So this button to select, this button here to go back, back one menu, go back to the top, go to resume, and then it'll show you this box here. Now for this box, you need to select input this game, because if you go input general, it'll change it for every game, so you don't want to do that. So you push this button might be different on yours, it might be this one. But on here, that's the select button now. All right, so now you can go down. So this has three buttons. So if I want to change it, I could change it to these top ones here instead, right? So I would push this button here, which is the select button. Right, and then I want that to be button three. I guess it would be this one. And you wait a bit. There you go. Now there's now set as button three. Button two, so I go push this. And it clears it. And I push that as button two. And then button one. Push that. And we want this one to be button one. Push that again. There you go. So now go to return to main menu. Once you get back here, you push your hotkey button, which will be your um, coin button, and this button at the same time. Go back into this menu, go to options, and then I want to turn this off now. Display main menu off. Go back, go to resume. All right, so now, right, this used to be the two arrow buttons, and now it's set. It used to be that, right? See, now it doesn't do anything, but now if I use these ones... Oh, it just started the game. Hang on. I did it too slow. I'll go back in. Yeah, so... See, now this one left or right left and then the middle one is now set so that's how you change the button every game will have all the correct buttons for it so let's say it's street fighter right it'll have six buttons so get a, might have to play around with it a bit so it's set all your kicks or all your punches at the top whichever way you like it and you got to do it for both sides both players so player one and player two Let me beat him. Yeah. And that's how you do that.